Well, the coronavirus causes cold symptoms. So runny nose, cough, and fever would be some of the most common symptoms experienced early on. Uh, it then can expand to more of a pneumonia-like illness. Everyone needs to pay attention to the coronavirus. Keep in mind that the experts are watching closely and there's a system in place at the university to monitor the coronavirus and risk to our students. Basic principles that apply that can keep you healthy just like with the flu. Don't touch your face, avoid being around people that are sick, uh, are two of the most important principles, and if you want more detail, the CDC has it. No, we're not handing out hand sanitizers, but there are 150 hand sanitizer stations strategically located around campus for anyone to use. If you are worried about the possibility, please call the health center and we can share advice or have you seen whatever is in your best interest. We just don't know right now if it is more dangerous than the flu, we gotta watch things closely. Everyone needs to be paying attention. UCF Global is closely monitoring all students and faculty for that matter that are studying uh, or working abroad. And they'll be communicating with our students about best steps to take to maintain your safety. People are certainly recovering from coronavirus. Lots of them are, in fact, um, the, the, the majority of, of people are recovering. Any illness may affect diabetic control. If you have a strep infection, your blood sugar can go up. So in that respect, yes, um, getting coronavirus will likely affect your diabetes. I think you should look at the CDC webpage and travel recommendations um, for advice about how to protect yourself. It's not the pool water that might expose you, but maybe the door handles and other objects that people are having a lot of contact with. So make sure to wash your hands frequently. The general public should not be wearing face masks. Um, face masks that uh, the general public are wearing uh, do not protect them from acquiring the coronavirus.